Hey guys, welcome back to another video. As you might have saw in my previous San Francisco apartment tour video, I recently got into skincare where, you know, I bought a lot of products with like cleanser, toner, vitamin C serum, essence, and all that jazz. And you know, I've been doing that skincare routine for almost over a month now, and I've definitely seen a lot of improvement with my skin complexion. My mom's been like, Edward, what the hell have you been doing? And the general consensus was that, you know, Edward, you're making a lot of progress, but if you want to take it to the next level, why not try some prescription medication? And with that, I'm so grateful to introduce today's sponsor, Curology. And also just a quick disclaimer too, obviously not only putting acne medication is going to solve everything. So with this 30 day challenge, I'm not only going to be using Curology alongside my skincare routine. I'm going to be drinking a lot more water every day. I'm going to stop eating junk food, fried food, or less than I normally do, maybe once or twice a week. So Curology is super easy. Just go on the website, use my link down below that I'll talk about later on with the promotion. So what you do basically is you fill out a survey, you talk about your skin complexion, is it oily or dry? What type of acne are you trying to get away? Like, are you getting a lot of red bumps? Like, you have a lot of acne scars? you want to fade and after you fill out the survey um fill in your shipping information so we got our medication for the month from curology so we open the box and it's pretty nice they give you a card curology love your skin every day that's what i'm trying to do you know what i'm saying so you get a white bag got the curology label your skin goals achieved and if we open it up you'll have three products so the first thing they have is a cleanser use a cleanser to clean your pores get rid of like small dirt and like small follicles that have been left on your skin do this twice a day and the next product that they give you is a moisturizer which is very important. Apply to face and neck during the day and night because it's important to moisturize. You don't want any flaky skin, but the main part is acne medication. So as we can see here, this medication was made specifically for me. It has my name, it has the formula, like what percentage I need for different types of chemicals that my face needs. And I've actually looked up this formula on like Reddit and like just past users. And the people that I saw who had a similar formula to me, when I saw their before and after pictures, their before pictures were definitely similar to mine, where in my case, my formula is made specifically to fight against uh, acne scars and make them fade away. And I don't really have dry or oily skin, so I don't need anything too extreme. But if you do have any problems, you can go on Curology's portal with your account and talk to your consultant and let them know about what problems are you having and they'll come up with a new formula to work better for you. And with Curology, you know, you're always taking photos all the time to update your consultant. You can keep track of your progress. I think it's a much more easier process than having to go set up an appointment with a dermatologist, you know, wait at the office, get a delay because, you know, they're busy working with other people. You know, like they'll just talk to you for a couple of minutes, be like, oh, okay, cool. Your skin's looking a lot better. Let's just keep on going with the medication. Here's our prescription. Go to Walmart and pick it up. This way it feels much more one-on-one, much more personable to me. And I really liked it. So if you're interested, make sure to click my link down below where you can get your first month of Curology completely for free. All you have to do is pay for shipping and handling, which is only $4.95. So once again, thank you to Curology for sponsoring this video. I want to be using this product for 30 days, including my original skincare routine, drinking more water, as I said, exercising more, eating more healthy. So yeah, I'll see you guys in a month and hopefully my skin gets a lot better. All right. And we're 30 days in the future. I don't know if you can tell through this video, but I took pictures of my right side, my left side, and my front. Here's a comparison of those pictures. You'll see quite a big difference actually. There's less redness on my skin. The acne scars and the darkness of the spots have reduced quite a bit. And obviously my skin's not gonna be fixed immediately in one month. You know, not all my dark spots are gonna go away. Not all my scars are gonna go away, but you can see that there's been improvement. So I plan on continuing with my current skincare routine and hopefully just let my skin improve more over time. One thing I was scared about was if my Curology medication was gonna interact in a bad way with my skincare products because, you know, I was scared if my skin would get flaky, it would get allergic reaction, you know, get rash or things like that, but it didn't, so I'm pretty happy with that. And also I just cut my hair, so I need to clean up, wash up. And after that, I gotta do my skincare routine, so I'll show you guys that. I know the title's gonna either say like eight or nine step skincare routine. Honestly, you're probably gonna be like, why the hell are you using so many products? Do you even need that many products? Why are you spending so much on that many products? And to be honest, before starting this, I had the same perspective. I always thought this was kind of extra, but you know, my skincare routine, I got it down to like two or three minutes every day, and I just do it day and night. And to be honest, it's probably the favorite part of my morning routine now. So yeah, let me clean up really quick, and I'll show you guys my skincare routine. So I do like the Korean thing where they do double cleanse. So you use an oil cleanser and you use a normal cleanser. First thing that you have to do is take out like two pumps, put this oil on your face, which kind of feels weird, but it actually feels really good. I hope I don't look too ugly doing this. And yeah, now I cover my entire face with the oil. This is pretty cool. You get some water, put it around your face, and now like the cleansing stuff comes out. So you know, like the white soap. So now I'm done with that, look warm water. I'm gonna rinse my face. And I'm gonna leave my face wet because this is what I saw from a YouTube tutorial. I don't know if it's completely right. But now from the second part of the double cleanse, which is the normal cleanser, not oil cleanser. I'm using this green tea foam cleanser. You don't need too much. I just use like this much. And you know, mix around with your hands and then slap on your face. Since there's already water in my face, I don't have to add it again. This maximizes the efficiency of how much product I need to use on my face. 
important thing is to also get underneath your neck and like your chin and jaw. That look really stupid right now. Look, this is how I get my face clean. And yeah, so this is what my face looks like. Oh my gosh, I'm a mouth. Normally I don't talk when I'm doing this, but now that my face is clean, you know, wow, I look ridiculous. But yeah, I'm gonna rinse it off now with lukewarm water. All right, so after cleansing, I like to use an exfoliator and I use these pads. These are with honey and lemon. And you first, so it's pretty cool, you just put your finger, I'll just take it off. You usually have to like grab it like this, but I don't like, but you know, Korean people, they're just too good. So they have this little slip down here, so you just put your finger underneath. So then you can just hold it like this. So it's a lot easier when I do that. And yeah, so I'm just gonna exfoliate my skin. What this does, it just basically drops off all the dead skin on my face and any particles that I didn't clean out from using my double cleanse. I don't do this every day. I do this twice a week as instructed in it. I don't know like the correct technique, but apparently you're supposed to like do this where you move it to the outside. So I'll do that. So that in here, outside my face, get underneath my neck. That's like the most important part for me. That's where I get a lot of acne. It's like side of my face and underneath my chin. And I don't know if the camera will pick it up, but you can see like some dark spots in here. So that's using the front side, now I'm gonna use the back side. Let's do that really quick. This side is the smoother one, so I think the other side's like a gauze, so it's more rough, but it picks up the particles. This is just to like clean it off. Cool, so we clean it off, throw this in my trash can. And after using this, uh, I just rinse again one more time with lukewarm water. Wipe my face. And yeah, so after doing my double cleanse and doing my exfoliating pad, now I put on my toner, which I'll show you in a second. And as you can see, this is my toner, and it says pH Bouncing Cleanser Toner. What this does, it basically, it restores pH balance to my face. So like once I start putting this on my face, I don't really feel how like the acids from my cleanser made my skin feel irritated and dry. Now it feels more, like you feel like it's like kind of sticky now, but in a good way where it makes your skin feel more normal. The next thing I use is vitamin C serum. So the one I use is Milano CC. It's like a Japanese brand that's really popular in Asia. But yeah, I just put like maybe three to five drops on my hand, not too much. Around areas where I have a lot of brown spots. Because vitamin C, what it does, it helps you with brightening all the dark spots on your face. So for me, it's like sunspots, so freckles, and also acne scars. Next step in my routine, it's called Essence. You definitely don't need this, but I actually have really dry skin, so even when I put on moisturizer, sometimes it doesn't satisfy me to the point where, you know, my skin feels very smooth. So once you put it on your face, oh my gosh, it feels so refreshing. What it does is press your face to absorb in moisturizer and other products better. And after Essence, I put on my moisturizer. What I'm using is from Claire's Rich Moist Soothing Cream. I only use this much. This one doesn't feel like super pasty or anything, so I really like it. So I rub it around my hand and then just put it over my face. Make sure you get underneath your jaw and neck. And yeah, I just moisturize my face. So after moisturizing my face, this is where like my skincare routine diverges, whether it's day or night. So if it's daytime, I need to put on SPF, which is sunscreen. And the sunscreen that I use, it's like a Japanese brand, like SPF 50, really nice. I'll leave on a pump just to show you guys what it looks like. So American sunscreens, they're kind of like pasty and like creamy and white, just like I was talking about the moisturizers before. But like they also smell, like I know there's a distinct smell for sunscreen. Some people like it, some people don't. I personally don't like it that much, so I don't like having it on my face. It also makes my face feel kind of oily, right? So with this sunscreen, I just use two pumps. It looks like this. It's not like super pasty. See, after I rub it around my hand, you don't see any like white leftover cream. It sounds really weird, but this stuff absorbs immediately. Like I put it on my face and if we wait like five seconds, now like when I touch my face, I don't even really feel it. I don't feel any pastiness or things like that. And it's SPF 50, which is really strong, which is really good. So when it's my daycare skincare routine, I put on sunscreen after my moisturizer, but it's going to be nighttime now. So let me show you guys what I do for nighttime. So for nighttime, after my moisturizer, what I do is I use eye cream. The skin around your eyes like here and like here, it's not exactly the same as the skin around the rest of your face. It's a lot more tender, and it's a lot more delicate. So you wanna use eye cream, which is actually just like moisturizer with like less potency or something, something like that. I just put a little bit like this much. Sorry for using my middle finger, not flipping you off, but I just put it underneath here. You know, get those eye bags out of here, you know what I'm saying? And then put it around here, the corner of my eye. And also put some above my eye too. So just get the whole perimeter, get the second droplet, and then do the same with my other eye. And yeah, that's like my skincare routine. This is the part where I use Corology. So you're only supposed to use Corology once a day at night, so that's what I do. It has my name and it has my formula. So, you know, specifically made for me, which is really cool. I just put in like two squirts, this is all you need. And I just basically attack the areas where I usually get acne. I don't put it where I don't get acne because I feel like it's kind of extra. So I put it on the corner of my chin. So what I realized is like, when I put it on pimples that are coming out, if I put it on before it's fully formed, the pimple actually doesn't come out to be as like big or pink or whatever. And whenever I put it on existing acne, it makes the acne go away faster than it normally does. So I'm pretty happy about that. So that's my skincare routine. If I wasn't talking, then 
which would probably have taken only two or three minutes. I'm gonna get Crawl for free for your first one with my link down below. All you have to do is pay $4.95 for shipping and handling. And then all my other products, I'll link them down in the description below too. For me personally, I wish I started this earlier because the lack of sunscreen that I use and the lack of moisturizer that I use, my skin got really dry and I got a lot of dark spots and freckles. Nothing wrong with freckles in that, but I just kind of prefer having a much more smooth overall complexion. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much to Curology for sponsoring this video. And let me know down in the comments below if any skincare products you guys use, any suggestions for me. And yeah, hope you have a wonderful rest of your day. Or if it's nighttime, I hope you have a wonderful rest of your night. And I'll see you for the next video. Peace. Thank you.